Hello everyone, this is Brovi1 Kenobi, also known as Kyle, and I am back here on my Feed the Beast server, and I also just realized I screwed up my recording because I am recording to the directory that had the previous episode I just recorded in, and now I'm going to have to sift through the footage to find out which goes with which, but that's my own problem and I will deal with that. So we are here to make the quarry, as I promised in the last episode. So we have here, we need to make 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 gears. So first things first, we're going to make a buttload of sticks. Well, we only have one gear. So we only need one, two, three, four, five, six. That should exactly give us enough gears. So I'll throw those back in. Now we need to convert every single one of these into an iron gear. No problem. Put iron around the wooden gear. No. You put stone around the wooden gear first. Because I am a dum dum. So now we have seven stone gears. Now you put iron around the stone gears, and you get seven iron gears. Now, this is where it gets tricky. So we get need three iron gears. So the other four become gold gears. One, two, three, four. We'll put these in our regular inventory for now. So now we put gold around the same way we did with iron, and you get a gold gear. Note that it can only be done on an iron gear. You can't put gold around a stone gear to get a gold gear. Now, we need two of these, but we also need two diamond gears. So, as you can imagine, you put diamonds around a gold gear and you get a diamond gear. So now we have two of those. So we have all the gears we need. We need the advanced circuit, which, we, if you don't remember how to make that, well go back and watch one of my other videos or just watch what I'm doing right now I'm not gonna explain it so we're gonna need a second circuit I believe maybe even a third one let's just make three okay so let's put one there put redstone in the four corners put glowstone in the middle well it doesn't matter glowstone and lapis can be switched back and forth like you could also do the recipe like this so we need we need one of those and what else we need the diamond drill. So to make the diamond drill, we need a mining drill. And we need to make a mining drill, we need a rebattery and an electric circuit and five steel plates. So I'm gonna have to go make some steel plates unless I have some. Do I have some laying around somewhere? We got three. It's not nearly enough. Well, we'll take the three that we got. Throw them in there. Um, what did I need to make that? So let's make the rebattery, and we already have a circuit, so we just need the rebattery. Which means I need more wire, actually. Let me just go. Oops. Uh, where's my plate bender? Let's just pl plate bend these. And I should have a buttload of wire in here that I was stripping down. So let's make this. Let's wait for these uh, steel plates to bend up. <laughs> Six and seven and eight and one more will give us nine. That's more than I'm gonna need. But hey, you know, better to be safe than sorry. So let's put the wires here and the rubber. Let's just turn these into as many as we can make. Twenty-three. Let's put the uninsulated wire back in the uninsulated wire area. We have lots of wire. Okay, so a rebattery is one of those. One of those. If I could only place blocks correctly, that or items correctly, that'd be awesome. So let's make our rebattery. So was it a rebattery? An electric circuit? I think those are backwards. Yes, they are. And then steel plates, like so. You know what? Before we do that, let's uh, let's make two of these, and I'll tell you why in just a moment. Let's make another rebattery. So two rebatteries, two circuits. We've got enough steel plates to make two of these. So let's make two. Mining drill. Hey, meet the dentist. So we can make two of them. Fantastical. Okay, what else do you need now? We need three diamond dust or diamonds or industrial diamonds two advanced circuits and two titanium plates so let's go bend up some titanium plates 
Now, we only need four of these, so I'm only going to do four. Because I don't know what else I might need titanium for, but I don't want to waste it. Because there's no getting it back once you uh, start. Okay, so let's get rid of the rest of that. Let's dump one of these, because we won't need it. Um, yeah, no, that's a circuit, it's important. Okay, so let's make two more circuits. I think we need, yeah, two more. So two more circuits, which both need to be converted into advanced circuits. Which means I need to grab more redstone. And one, two. Believe we have everything we need to make the diamond drill now. Let's put the mining drill there. The circuit, the two of those plate things, and the three diamond dust things. Gets us the diamond drill, and we'll make two of those as I mentioned. Okay, I think we've got everything we need. So diamond drill, two diamond gears, two gold gears, three iron gears, and the advanced circuit makes us finally a quarry. The reason I made two of these is for the reason I will show you in just a second. Let's go in here. Mm -hmm. There we go. <laughs> So the diamond drill, as uh, some of you may or may not know, and uh, I'm just going to do a quick little demonstration over here. So you see these here? Yeah, I can mine stuff pretty quickly with it. It acts as a shovel and a, uh, I don't really want the snowball. Basically acts as a shovel, and I don't think it really works well on wood. No, not really. But, if I come over her... No, I got rid of all the obsidian, of course, already, so... But... It breaks stone at a fairly reasonable rate. So it works on stone and dirt. Essentially, is the whole point. And it runs off of power, so it'll eat the natural power that's already stored in my advanced nano chest plate. So that's not too bad, it just means I have to charge the chest plate more often as I use it. Same thing, it's like the same thing as the rock cutter, but the rock cutter has silk touch. Uh, if I put silk touch on a diamond drill, I'll no longer need the rock cutter, basically. Um, yeah, the rock cutter is good for early on, but the only way to get, like, you can't just enchant this, I don't believe. No. So the only way to get Silk Touch on it is to make a book or find a book with Silk Touch on it. And I don't remember what books I have. Respiration, Bane of Arthropods. I do have Efficiency 5. That's actually a really good one to put on your diamond drill. <laughs> I'm going to go do that right now, as a matter of fact. So, uh, diamond drill, Efficiency 5. And you would get a diamond drill with Efficiency 5 for 8 levels. I think I'm going to use my 8 levels. So let's go back to that little uh, watering hole thing over there, just so I can show you guys now what the difference between the regular one was and Efficiency 5. Okay, so... Actually, it doesn't seem that... I mean, it eats absolutely eats through dirt, though. Yeah. Pretty much. But, uh, yeah. I don't know. I think it's cool. So, this will, be a, this will basically replace my shovel and my pickaxe. So, uh, unless I want fortune or silk touch. But I have the rock cutter for silk touch. So, fortune is the only other thing I'm missing. So I will keep a fortune pickaxe on me, so probably keep that one. But the rest of these, I think, are going to go away now. These two guys are going to go into storage. They were good tools. 
when I needed them, but they're no longer needed. So we still need the axe, we need our fortune pick, we need our swords. Um, there is one other electrical item I can make called the chainsaw. So there's the chainsaw and the advanced chainsaw, which is diamonds, overclocker upgrades, and those. Uh, but basically the chainsaw acts as the um, axe and I believe the sword and shears as a matter of fact, if I recall correctly. Um, so you get those three things in one. The, this counts as the the pickaxe and the shovel. The other one is the other items. So it's a pretty good way to compact your so you only have to carry around a few things and then you won't have to carry around extras because it just runs off of energy rather than durability which would be kind of nice. But I guess that's going to do it for this one. This was basically a diamond drill and quarry episode. Uh, in the next episode, I'm going to get finish my uh, quarry setup off camera. Um, and then I will actually get all the supplies I need to actually go, go out and set up a quarry. Uh, all this off camera. And then in the next episode, we're going to actually set up the quarry. And then probably after that, I'm going to take a bit of a hiatus from recording. Because I am recording this currently on July 29th. And, uh, well, I'm not sure when this is going to go up, but I'm sure it's going to be probably about a month from now at the very least. So, uh, if you're watching this past August 29th, then I was correct. If not, well, I stand corrected. And I must have ran out of things to upload, but, uh, right now it doesn't look like that's going to be the case. So anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next episode. Peace.